I'm Vivian Hovey and my role at the exhibit was to do a bunch of research on the history of the College of Family and Consumer Sciences and basically organize it into something that we could put on display. The first half of my time was spent doing research, so being able to look through um, primary sources from the beginning of facts all the way till today and really being able to just gain a general knowledge of how facts has grown and developed throughout the last 100 years. And then once I had all of the objects picked out and all of my research done, I was able to start grouping the objects together and write out descriptions so that we were just able to tell the story well. In the exhibit, um, the main room is about the history of the college, so it has things about Mary Cresswell, the origin of Sewell and Dawson Halls, about how the college helped and aided during World War I and World War II. And then we also have a room dedicated to each department within the college and about a little bit about the history and how it's developed and some of the programs and research it has going on today. And we also do have a room dedicated to the historic textiles collection where you'll be able to look at some of the historical textiles that we have from the College of Family and Consumer Sciences. I really just loved being able to learn about the outreach that FACTS is able to do through the research that is done within the college, um, how FACTS cooperates with Cooperative Extension to be able to really bring the things that we are discovering and learning to the community and really put that into action. And I also really enjoyed learning more about the earlier history of the College of Family and Consumer Sciences and how it opened the doors of the university to women and has really been breaking down barriers ever since. Getting to put this exhibit together was really such a privilege for me um, as a student in FACTS. I just really, really cherish the experience and it's something that I probably won't ever be able to do anything like this ever again. So I really loved being able to do it and really glad that I got to take my part in telling the story of FACTS. I think that this exhibit is going to be really great for anyone associated with FACTS to come see. It's a great way to learn more about how the college came to be and all that it's been working for and towards for the last 100 years. So if you're a faculty, alumni, or student, you should definitely come by and see it. And it's open now through May 18th and you can come see it any day from 8 to 5.